another one of my co-MCs this evening. Let me just like tell you a little bit about this one. The very first time, of course, I told you my dad's a preacher. The very first time when I let slipped out of church, like what, 12 years ago, from directing the choir and slid down to a bar in Houston called the Copa. I walked in, sat down, and saw this next performer performing. I was totally stunned, shocked, and appalled, and couldn't believe what I saw. She is probably one of the most fabulous entertainers I've ever seen, and one of my dearest friends. Please welcome the very first Miss USA that will be doing Evening Gown, Naomi Sims. All right, sister, woman, girl. Her pump blew off. Thank you. One more time, a nice round of applause for Mr. Bubba McNeely. Bubba Licious. I'll make this real quick. I have three things that I must say. First of all, I apologize for not being here for Stars of the USA last night. Number two, thank you, Mr. Bird, for letting me come back again this year after what great fun I had last year in Atlanta. Number three, tonight is bittersweet in a way because it's exactly the 15th anniversary, 15 years, since I won the title of Miss USA in 1977. And it was the, it was the second confrontation of many between Michael Andrews and I. And so I have this one thing, this thought, this belief that I honestly feel strongly about. That is, it goes, if one of you remembers my name, I'll live forever. Well, tonight I remember Michael, and if everyone here in this audience tonight will just remember one of their friends that they've lost, then we'll double the capacity of this room, and we'll have much, a much better night. So let's remember somebody and bring them here with us tonight. Michael, I love you. <laughs> 